What's up, y'all? It's your boy Jawan, and I am in the park with my friend Jamie hey. and the Harlem, my best friend. She's about to have a little photo shoot with Pets of Broadway, so get some behind the scene actions of what's about to happen for that. That's gonna be exciting. Dog photo shoots, ain't that something? Craziness. I'm a proud daddy. A model. I'm a proud daddy. Look at her just looking back. Look at her, y'all. Yeah. She knows how to work the camera. Look at that model. Oh my gosh. My dog takes after her father, you know. <laughs> All right, y'all are about to see me get my wig put on. And that right there. It's Hi. Natalie! She's carrying my baby right now. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> well, she's carrying her husband's child, but I claimed her child is my child. You know I got a lot of godchildren. I got seven. She, it's going to be honorary number eight. Ooh. Yes! You're going to have to have a lot of friends mad at me because I just said that. So I just want to let you know that. But she, she puts my wig on, so this is how I get prepared for Melvin. A lot of you guys wanted to see this uh, behind the scenes. You know, this is... This is usually a private moment. <laughs> We're gonna get this wig put on. So Natalie, how long have you been like working with wigs and, and um, hair? Since I moved to New York in 2014. Oh yeah, yeah, you're about a year before me, or two years. That's it. I came That's out here two years mean? before you. I came out. Well, 2013. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. great. I think I've done 13 Broadway shows. Oh, see. You know what? <laughs> she had to throw that out there. She had to throw it out there. Thirteen I've shows. Worked. Yeah. Listen, she. Booked. This is my favorite, though. This is my favorite. Um, she said that right. Yeah, yeah. You're my favorite. You know, I call him Frank, by the way. So my wig is Frank. It's the only wig I wear throughout the whole show. And you know, me and Frank has a we have a love hate relationship. So sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> The hair under it don't want to be right, and they don't mm -hmm. they don't <laughs> mesh. But today's a good day. Today's a good day for Frank. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have uh, five ladies in the show, and you've met three already. And now he is one more. This is our dance captain extraordinaire, women, woman, five, four, three, two, and one. She covers all the women. She's our swing. And this is Mrs. Esther Antoine. What's up, y'all? Who is actually coming here to give me notes. Here we go. Just one. Oh, just, just one. See, one. listen, I remember when I first started, y'all, and she would come in here, and I would just, like, hang, hang my head because I know... It's going to be pages and pages and pages and pages of notes and rehearsal the next morning because I was new. I was a newbie. And now she comes and gives notes here and there, which I am so grateful for because that means I'm doing what I'm supposed to be doing. Or she paying attention to somebody else. <laughs> one or the other. Because sometimes... I can sometimes, say there's only one note today as opposed to pages and pages. Yeah. Because right? I remember one time, like, I remember, like, I'll be doing a show and then the next day I'd be like, okay, I know I messed up. I was on number three. She's like, okay, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> so then I got out my head. I was like, let me just do my show. Okay. And you're doing it so well. So she's about to so give me a note on camera. So we're about to hear it for the first time like you are. So you about to hear it and I'm about to hear it. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what it is. All right. When, um, and if you don't know me by now, right at the end, when you go, ah, uh, ooh, step on the ooh. You're starting to go early. Ah, uh, ooh. Ah. Uh, ah, uh, step. Gotcha. Thank you. Oh, that's so, easy. Well, that's easy. You're awesome. Have well, she's you. not on any social media, so you ain't gonna follow her. The only time you're gonna see her is right here, so get it in while you can. Hey, y'all, what's up? Okay, so I'm about to answer some questions that I got um, from you guys. And so the first question is Uh oh, come in. Hey, hey, sorry. Uh oh, hey, y'all, James is. 
Oh, rudely interrupted the question session. What's up? Oh no! Why see you always leaving? Everybody always want to leave me because you always doing stuff. Look, I was coming into the room. I'm still gonna be nice. You should. Okay. What you here for? Look, I bought you something, but I'm about to take it back. No! I I should I take it back? I think I should take it back. Listen, this is my I'm first gift Jesus ever gave me. That's the I'm, first thing the he first ever thing gave I, me. No. That is the first I thing I gave he ever you gave friendship. Me. I didn't ask for that. <laughs> take the damn bag. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, it's so nice. He know he, you know I love a book bag. Listen, I love a book bag. This is really nice, James. I got my drawers in the video now, but nobody cares about that. This is really nice. Nice to see you guys. Okay, so since you're here, I mean, I was trying to do some questions, but you know, I guess you can answer them. Who you play? What's your name? You don't I mean, know who people I. People don't know you. Uh, these okay. Are, these are my fans. These oh, are your okay. fans. <laughs> what? Where'd you start? Uh, where did I start? In like in your life? journey, yeah. I just was let, started let us in know. El Paso, Texas, which is where I was born. Mm -hmm. uh, that's where I was. That's where I started. Uh, he always gotta have a smart mouth. That's one thing about James Harkness, is that he'll always he can't ever answer a question without you. having a smart mouth. Even in his you. interview with you. another um, you. internet source, you you know they asked him what was the first thing that you do when you get home, and you know what he said. Put my key in the door. I don't understand. What's the first thing you do when you get home? That's 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 not what they were asking. Though. That is exactly what that's the question not. was. <laughs> and then you had to be smart. This is what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> this is what I'm saying. Like, oh, oh, jerk. First of all, well, wait a minute. Now, I I showed you some what in that interview. He did show me some love, and in an interview about <sighs> about. Okay, he gave me something. And you know now, people have seen it. <laughs> love. I love you too. So, <laughs> what's up, y'all? Good morning. So, I'm headed to the Javits Center for Circle of Sisters right now. Um, and for those of you who do not know who, what Circle of Sisters is, it's the biggest and the largest black women's expo in New York Convention. It's hosted by WBLS, and so there's going to be a lot of seminars and informative um, conferences and meetings and interviews happening. And you got your favorite people there, like myself, and I think Deborah Cox is there this year. Um, Full Force, Ain't Too Proud's going to be there. Um, my homeboy Anthony Brown, Hezekiah Walker, and Yolanda Adams, just on and on and on and on and on. And it's one of the biggest things that's in New York. And I'm excited to be a part of it. I'm excited to be there. And hopefully um, we get some footage of the inside and what's going on. Who y'all? So I got my brothers who about to represent A2 Proud. Say what up y'all. Good morning. You know, it's early, early. It's early in the morning. His voice ain't warm. My voice is warm. Oh, it's warm. Oh, it's warm. Oh. He was up at six thirty this morning. Paul James. Paul James. Also known as his Tinted Tones Junior. Ooh, this throat. He got the Layla Hathaway uh, tritone. Especially early in the morning. Breakfast on your table. Yeah. Hey. Make sure. All right, I said that. <laughs> they about to get ready for sound check. We don't have to pay for that. We don't have to pay for Yeah, anything else we gonna have, y'all gonna have to pay for. But Circle of Sisters, they're about to perform or going to perform in this room. It looks like it looks like probably like a thousand seats, fifteen hundred maybe. You know. They about to do their thing. I can't wait. This time I get to just watch and enjoy. He's a brave soul. <laughs>
Sing pretty. Marcus. Jelani. Uh, uh, Sean. Corey. Saint. Y'all sing pretty now. Look at these boys. They are going on at the sister, uh, circle of sisters. Are you sure you want to step in and do this? <laughs> here that means you made it thus far through all the journeys through all the cuts through all the transitions of this week's episode i thank you so much for watching and staying with me throughout it all you're amazing and if you want to know who this is in the background plan my brother michael kilgore please do yourself a favor go get that album it just came out it is solid, it's great. My friend is singing and he sounds amazing on it. Uh, it's gonna be the best thing you've ever done. It's all on all social media platforms, all um, music platforms, iTunes, every, everywhere. Go get it, please. Um, and as always, I'm gonna leave you with an inspirational quote that my history teacher, Mr. Lockridge, would say, down with dope, up with hope, you're dismissed. Tune in next week for another episode of all about that bass, bass, bass. I love y'all so much. Thank you.